Today's comment of the day is by G. Uh, my man G said I might get this game. Hey man, if you ever, you know, see me playing Noida and you enjoy it, uh, you might want to get it. I'm going to be honest. It's a really fun game. The only reason why I have it is because I was watching someone play and I was like, wow, I've never seen a game like this. I'm going to check it out. I bought it, got it, started playing it, and here I am, you know, enjoying it. hundreds of hours of this game. So um, if you're already considering getting the game, you might want to try it out. It's really cheap. So, you know, go ahead. You'll have a lot of fun. I appreciate you leaving this comment, and I hope to see you in the future videos, my friend. Let's do this. What's up, guys? Welcome back to another video. Today, we're going to see what happens when you stack 100 hungry ghost if you guys don't know what the hungry ghost perk is basically it spawns a little ghost that floats around your character follows you around and sometimes it'll eat up projectiles uh which is really interesting now a side effect of when it eats projectiles it'll actually give your person a damage boost two damage boosts to be exact the first damage boost will add 15 damage to the projectile of your wand and the second damage boost will add a well it'll times 1.25 damage boost so if you're using a projectile that doesn't have damage such as the music notes it'll add damage to that projectile and then it'll multiply it by 0.25 or 1.25 however what happens if you keep stacking these perks you know what i mean what happens when you have 100 of these perks are you just going to be overpowered or is it just not going to be the case that's what i'm trying to find out today and uh yeah let's go ahead and get started also guys if there's a certain perk that you want to see stacked on the channel let me know in the comments down below just say hey do this perk and uh, i'll shout you out do the video and uh yeah so hopefully i see you guys comment and let's get started in today's video so we're gonna start off in the uh, in the holy mountain here just gonna skip the uh gonna oh my god is that three hung i definitely did not spawn these in huh but we're gonna pick up one of these real quick and we're just gonna see what happens okay we're just we're gonna leave the mountain here we're gonna see what happens uh when you have one hungry ghost on you let me see if i can find an enemy real fast so if i go over here to the ladybugs they should shoot a projectile at me and uh once they actually shoot it and my anger goes eats the projectile which i'm hoping that he does shoot me shoot me shoot me hit me why are you why are you going away hit me what are you scared of okay I, uh, there you go so my uh my angry ghost ate it and i got myself a damage boost up for four seconds but as you can see it wasn't very reliable um by the time that the enemy actually hits you you could have just killed the enemy yourself you know what i mean so uh, let's see what happens when you actually stack five of these together meaning this damage can wrap up fairly quickly right so i'm gonna do a little bit of a test experiment just to just to show you guys how insanely crazy this can be so i got two wands here with two different spells on it one with spark bolt and one with the magic guard my spark bolt does what three damage right now the magic guard if you guys don't already know the magic guard acts as projectile so if i cast this my magic ghost will actually eat the projectiles and i'll automatically give myself a boost so if i cast this a little bit you know what i mean give myself a few boosts and then i shoot this guy 300 damage with no extra modifiers at all on the spark ball it went from three to 300 that's a times one that's a times 100 percent boost but we only have five magic ghosts now let's go an extra mile and let's go to 50 let's let's see what happens when we actually get 50 of these guys so now i've got 50 magic ghosts and that's a lot of that's a lot of ghosts following me around. So we go back and we do the exact same thing. And we just start spamming the living crap out of this. And then we shoot something. 47,000 damage. With one hit. And I'm not even sure all the ghosts even ate a projectile. If I just sit here and just, just hold it. You know what I mean? I might need a wand with a faster recharge rate. To really, really spam the mess out of these magic guards. Now if I shoot it again, I think it's dead. The statue is dead. Let's go to the next statue. All right, we're going to do the exact same thing. We're just going to hold it down for like five seconds just to see what happens, just so they can all get hungry and eat because they're all hungry ghosts. And then we shoot the projectile. What's that? What's that? it's dead again i think that was like 280,000 damage with one hit just from a 50 hungry ghosts. What would happen if we had a hundred hungry ghosts with a wand with a faster recharge speed to feed all of those hungry ghosts? Let's find out. All right, so we now have 100 hungry ghosts you see the notification going off like crazy but if i go over here it says 100 hungry ghosts so i changed my wand up a little bit and now there's practically no recharge time no refresh rate no nothing it'll instantly go i have 100 hungry ghosts i don't actually know if there's a cap for this perk or not i'm not sure if that's a hungry 100 ghost or not but uh we're, we're just gonna hold this down feed them all real quick hopefully the statue doesn't actually break shoot it bro that I, I don't even know what number that was i don't even know what number that was but it was a lot that was a lot of numbers. I'm pretty sure this statue... Yep. The statue's dead. 
that 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 guy not coming back. We, that guy's out of service. We can't use him no more. We can no mm -mm, no repairs, none, no refund, no nothing, no -uh, no insurance. Mm -mm, can't use him no more. Let's 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 this guy though. This guy over here, he's got a little bit of juice. Let's let's. I just want to do it again. Let's just, let's just feed all our kids, children. Okay, all our children are fed, and then we shoot it, and that's a big number. That was more than like twenty digits. Okay. Now I know what you're saying. A hundred angry ghosts. How many, how many, is that even possible to achieve in a natural run? Is a hundred angry ghosts actually possible to get in the game? It is possible, but realistically, who's going to do that? You know what I mean? So we're going to go on a little bit of a realistic slide and really see how overpowered this will be in a real run. So we're in more of a realistic run here, and I got five angry ghost perks on me. I made up a, a few wands here, spawned them in, and... I just put together just a little something something not too big pretty much the bare bone minimum of what this is actually capable of and if i go to the target dummy over here and i start using it as you can see i'm getting the buff and then my spark bolts will uh start to shoot out and i'm doing 300 damage 180 300 630 you know what I mean? That's a lot of damage for one spark bolt. Um, and the fact that you could go crazy with this and expand upon it and make it do insane amounts of damage is nutty. I'm going to show you what I mean. Now, I might have gone a little bit overboard, but uh, this is definitely for demonstration purposes. I made a wand here a little bit. Uh, if you guys want me to explain everything that goes on with this wand and actually like go deep in into detail, let me know in the comments and I'll make a video on it. But in this video, I won't be explaining it. I'm just going to show what you can actually do in the end game of noida with this type of build so i'm just gonna build it up and then eventually i'm gonna shoot and when i do forty-five thousand damage um i have to keep in mind that the the magic guards will kind of interfere but usually they just don't you know what i mean and if i shoot again you can see I, i'm pretty much on target and the, and the thing is dead so i'm in the spell labs if you guys don't know what a spell labs is it's a little bit of a mod just so we can see how much damage this actually is capable of doing so we're going to do the exact same thing again. Just point it at the little target dummy. And that's how much damage. The, the regular dummy, the statue doesn't do its justice, my friend. It doesn't do its justice. That's 900,000. Easily a, a trillion damage. Easily with end game, end game builds. Easily a trillion. Just five perks and a few modifiers, bro. And you can achieve pretty much one-shotting anything in the entire game bro literally anything but yeah i hope that you guys enjoyed what 100 angry ghosts would look like in the game of noida if you guys want to see any other perks like that um let me know in the comments down below if you have any questions let me know in the comments down below and be sure to check out my twitch streams where i do this stuff live every day uh my name is smorge over there leave me a follow and i would appreciate it if i see your beautiful faces there um and yeah hopefully you guys enjoyed the video and i'll see you guys in the next one have a great day evening morning and afternoon my friends peace out